Kia ora, talofa, good morning, ni hao, and namaste. It's 9.30 a.m. and you are with Ramil for a program called Te Wa Fanu. Time for family. It consists of musical fun with gambling harm awareness information for half an hour. Here we go, Te Wa Fanu with Ramil. I'm a public health worker for Salvation Army. Oasis. If you have any gambling problem, please do not hesitate to contact us. I can ensure your privacy will be protected. Remember, prevention is better than cure. So if you have any gambling problem, please contact us through 0800 530 000 0800 530 000 or 0637703317. We are based in 41 Perry Street, Masterton. So don't forget to contact us if you have having the problem gambling. So after a lockdown, finally I'm back to the studio and it's really nice to meet you all of you. Hope everyone is safe and healthy and still um, we need to be careful and be kind till we'll, we'll go to level one and uh, yes, so we, we need to help each other in our community. And lots of things, uh, positive things and lots of negative things has been changed uh, during this lockdown time. So be supportive to each other, be kind to each other and help each other. So today I'm going to provide some information regarding gambling harm and I'll be talking about online gambling because of lockdown time uh, lots all the venues were closed so most of the people uh, were gambling through um, online technology so I'm going to talk about little bit about that today in this program so before moving this program ahead I'm happy to put uh, one nice songs for you guys and uh, yeah it's the song is uh, Lady Gaga poker face from Lady Gaga and please enjoy this song thank you So here's to you Can still have a laugh At the end of the day Hi, I'm back here. Looks like some technical problem with my uh, songs here. So I'll try to do my best again. So let's hear this song and please enjoy. Kiora Talofa, good morning, Nihao, and Namaste. So, I'll be sorting out this uh, problem with these songs. So, yeah, till that time, uh, I am happy to share the knowledge and share some information with you all. So, today, uh, I'm going to talk about Oasis and how Oasis. Uh, has put on for online gambling uh, how we can be avoiding on online gambling how we can go away from online gambling how we can divert ourselves um, as we know that we are oasis we are dedicated to providing judgment free services to the community to minimize gambling harm we understand this time can be difficult for you and for your family. 
Our aim is to help you through this time by offering our service via phone, email, internet, video and providing any information you need. But even in this, uh, during this uh, time level 2 we are open so you can visit us uh, in our office also uh, by now but uh, we have a service through phone, email, internet, video. Some brief information on some online gambling blockers that are uh, very useful for all of us can be shared here today. So regarding Lotto exclusion, if you find your use of online Lotto games has increased during this time, Lotto has put in, in place some helpful tools. Blocking yourself from games. You can do this via My Lotto Online account. This will automatically stop any subscription for games. Lower your spending limits. You can do this via your account. Access your account balance. Then settings, then spending limits. Exclusion from email reminders this is done automatically if you block yourself from lotto games and can also un unsubscribe via email so as we all know that gambling is an inter entertainment that is common in new zealand and 90 percent of us gamble gambling occurs when we risk something of value usually money on an uncertain outcomes so these are the few online gambling exclusion process I'm sharing with you. And what are the tools you can use to avoid gambling and especially online gambling? How you can exclude it from online gambling? I'm sharing with you today. Yeah, as you, uh, as you have, as we know that many New Zealanders enjoy buying the odd lotto ticket. And I have recently shared you how you can block yourself from Lotto yourself or my Lotto online account. Playing occasional pokies game or enjoying our day out at the races. However, for some people gambling becomes addictive and causes havoc for their family, fanu, finances, work and friendships. You are particularly at risk if you use pokey machines, gamble online or go to the casio, casino often. I, I, I want to add up some key points. Gambling is addictive so it can easily get out of hand. It can harm you in many ways. It can lead to ill health, emotional and psychological distress. So and also it can lead you to financial harm, poor performance at work or even at study, relationship problems and ultimately leading to the crime. Because gambling is an addictive behavior, it's really hard to stop on your own. It's important to get help before things get worse for you and your family. Don't wait and think it will be it will get better because it's very unlikely to do so without help. Losing face and not wanting to admit to gambling. Addiction is a common problem. It is important that you seek help with a trained counselor before it gets out of the hand. Often people who gamble are also affected by other mental health issues such as anxiety and depression. So you may need help with this too. Gambling also hurts other people close to you. Every gambler affects between 5 and 10 other people. If you live with someone who gambles, it's important 
that you also get help and support for yourself. So, sharing this information, I like to add up other online exclusion tools. So, regarding regarding TAB exclusion, this is useful online exclusion tool that is operated via the TAB website and your personal account. You can exclude yourself across all programs that span TAB wagering sites. Simply log in and access your account settings or call the TAB help desk on 0800 102 106. Bait blocker, it is very important too. This is a free app service you can download onto your phone, computer, etc. You can exclude yourself from multiple gambling sites for a selected period. Exclusion length can be extended but cannot be removed or shortened. Game ban. This is also one of the important uh, online tools that can that is effective for exclusion from online gambling. This is an app that has described is very effective. It works by blocking you from online gambling sites across all browsers. There are two ways to use game ban either use the tool the cool off function or the exclusion to use the cool off function it cost 5.19 monthly and the exclusion function cost 4.34 monthly so talking about more about the services of salvation army oasis here at the Salvation Army, our focus is to help out the community. If you find that you or someone you know need, needs help in other areas, then please find someone we, that we, our services we offer. The Salvation Army Bridge, this is a program dedicated to those who need help with alcohol and drug support. During this time, services are offered via phone, email, etc. Please call 0800-530-000 during and also you can contact us through the Facebook page, definitely. Food, clothing and furniture. You can access with this area via community ministries, corps churches for a full list of Salvation Army centers, please go Salvation Army help dash food, clothing and furniture. So in Netherlands you can contact 0800-530-000. Now regarding Masterton, in Masterton we, we have one new counselor of uh, Salvation Army Oasis. His name is Steve Eds and he is providing full free services for the people who are having to support the people who are having problem with the gambling. Steve Eds has joined us recently and please contact me or our office or Steve. Uh, our office is based in 41 Perry State Masterton and you can contact us through our number 06 3703317 06 3370 So you definitely if you need any help, if you need any support, please do not hesitate to contact us. I know we are always there to support you. And <coughs> so sorry. And <coughs> I'm trying to put the music, but uh looks like it's not working on technical ways. So I'll try one best to put one nice music for you guys and let's see how it goes uh,
Just wanna be enough, just wanna be enough And I hope this will change Just wanna be enough, just wanna be enough And you said you don't wanna talk about it But I knew every word that I just said Kia ora, talofa, good morning, ni hao ai naoste and definitely we have some technical problem today here with the computer and the songs so please uh, do not mind for this i'll continue with this program i'll be with you next 10 15 minutes no worries and i like to share some more information during this time so uh, sorry i couldn't put the songs and um, it will be sorted out soon so there won't be any issues, I guess, in coming program. So before sorting out the problem with the songs, I like to um, share some more information regarding gambling. So uh, definitely, I want to mention that who is most at risk of problem gambling? Anyone is at risk, but you are more at risk of your gambling getting out of hand if you are depressed lonely or have compulsive disorders if you use several different gambling products particularly pokies casino games and racing sports betting etc if you are a maori or pacifica chinese or korean man uh yeah uh, yeah i i i don't know why it is um saying like this it's maybe the, the stats because of the stats but uh, i don't believe in particularly focusing on certain people um yeah and if you are an international student or recent immigrant if you are isolated from new zealand culture especially if you have english as a second language if you gamble $500 or more at a time, if you bet on overseas gambling websites, if you are a substance abuser, if you live in an area of socioeconomic deprivation where you are expected to more poker machines. So these, these are the important points that you need to keep on your mind. And definitely, what are the signs of gambling might be a problem. Then you can say, okay, I'm having a gambling problem. So what are the signs? Uh, I have I've, uh, mentioned these signs before in different programs too, uh, in different episodes. But it's still like to continue in different way uh, to let the people in our community know that now I'm having a problem with the gambling or I'm having gambling problem because I'm chasing the lose loss by trying to win back money if I've already lost and I'm finding that when I stop gambling I've run out of money I'm trying to win money or borrow money to pay the debts. So this type of signs, if you find, I'll, I'll continue putting the signs that might be a problem gambling and you need a help, you need a support. So do not hesitate to contact us at 0637033317 and it's a free of service or you can contact in our 0800 number. So, sometimes uh, 
people might be on problem gambling if they lose the track of time if they they are feeling guilty about your about their gambling if people is spending more more on the gambling than they wanted and needing to gamble with more money to get the same feeling of excitement and if people are lying about money how much money they were spending on gambling and how often they are gambling that is also one of the signs of gambling pro- person having gambling problem in addition to that if you gamble because you feel stressed or lonely if you feeling or if you regretting after gambling that is also signs of problem gambling if you are depressed or anxious after a gambling sessions if you borrow money if you lose interest in other stuff these are the typical signs of problem gambling not only this if you if you have received criticism in the past for gambling and if you still continue gambling definitely it's a problem gambling so if you have a problem gambling place i'm repeating you do not hesitate to contact us and we are based in 41 perry street masterton salvation army the oasis and the services we provide is free so you can contact us anytime and i'm really sorry for today that uh, our we are having technical problem with our music uh, so yeah uh, hopefully it will be sorted out soon and uh, so for this program uh, i like to mention for uh, or i like to share more information is you know that during the lockdown time i try to bring different experts it's every friday and hopefully you had you really enjoyed that program uh age um uh, during this lockdown t- during the lockdown time from level uh, during log level 4 i still there were lots of people who were sharing experiences with us and i try to bring them every friday to share t- with our community with our people and here yeah. Uh, and also provided other different information that people might need um and yes so because people were um, f- were having problem financially students were having problem financially so we try to help in different way uh, so uh the I'll I'll come back with you every fortnightly and Friday on same way and we'll sort it out the problem with the um, music and if you want to share some experience some knowledge please do not hesitate to contact Aero FM uh, on Friday 9:30 a.m. then we can have a straight talk also uh, if you need help and then yeah please contact aero fm there is a phone number and contact me directly on the live show through the aero fm if you have something to share or if you want to if you want some information regarding the problem gambling so if we all know that four out of every five adult new zealanders gamble and one in five gamble weekly or more Lotto raffles and instant kiwi are the most common forms with lotto player by over half of the adult kiwis at least once a year however pokies are the most harmful form of gambling the majority of people who seek help for their gambling problems do so because of non casino pokies that is found in pubs Casino gambling including pokies and table games is the second largest category. 
two out of every five regular pokies users already have a gambling problem or are at risk of developing one non casino pokies are most likely to be found in more deprived areas of new zealand each pok each pokies takes an average of 47500 per year and usually from pockets of those who can least afford it in all the areas there is one pokey machine for every 465 people in poorer areas there is one pokey machine for every 75 people so this is what the data says i took it from page problem gambling foundation's data of uh, march 2017 so this type of data will show you the problem of gambling in new zealand itself and locally also i'm going to share i've already shared you lots of information regarding locally starts of gambling but in future also i'll keep on sharing with you uh, any new starts coming any new starts i find i'll keep on sharing with you how bad it is uh, the gambling problem gambling in our community even as a, in a, in our nation and so these are the things um, i like to share with you today and again i like to say sorry for a technical problem today we're having to play the songs and uh so uh the more i can say about um, is online gambling please be careful during this time for the online gambling and i have already mentioned you um about how you can um how ca- you can exclude it from lotto how you can exclude it from tav and what are the online online tools you can use to block online gambling in your mobile computers uh, like as bet blocker game ban so these are the important things again i want to repeat about um, blocking in the phone or computer bet blocker this is a free app service you can download into your phone computer etc you can exclude yourself from multiple gambling sites for a selected period exclusion length can be extended but cannot be removed or shortened and another one is gamban this is an app that has described as very effective it works by blocking you from online gambling sites across all browsers there are two ways to use gamban either use a cool off function or exclusion function to use the cool off function it cost 5.19 monthly and the exclusion function it's 4.34 monthly so if you want to, if you are having problem gambling through the online um, technology either phone or through computer please be quick to use these tools either bet blocker or gamble and bet blocker is completely free so with uh, passing this type of information please stay safe be kind to each other and i'll be back with more information and with some musics and uh, next fortnight but our program will be running every fr- friday 9:30 am to 10 10 am and till that time enjoy your weekend take care and look after each other and thank you so much ciao see you next fortnight and program will be repeated every friday bye thank you and enjoy your weekend